Let's just add whatever. Let's just go for it. It's recording. I know. I was let's, just keep, let's just keep it going and we'll just have a nice conversation. Oh, hello. <laughs> All right. Well, hi. I'm Courtney Portell. I'm from the class of 2009. Hold, please. That's our daughter back there. So one second. Hi, I'm Courtney Portell. I'm from the class of 2009. I played basketball at William & Mary. I'm Megan Moldlevy. I played tennis at William & Mary. I'm from the class of 2007. For me, college was a really... Um, it was a time of just figuring out who I was and... Um, I, you know, got there and I, there were things going on with me personally and just coming to terms with who I was and being a lesbian and basketball was like my place and that's where I just felt comfortable. I had a family. Um, I never felt like I had to hide who I was. For me, you know, uh, I have never felt different or less than. Uh, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm a woman. I'm black, uh, I'm gay, and you know, all of these things, in my opinion, yes, they're part of who I am, but they don't, they don't define me. I am a person, I'm a human being, I'm a, I'm a loving being, I'm a mother, I'm a sister, I'm a, I'm a friend, like so many other people. So I think my time at William & Mary was affirming because nobody looked at us any different. Nobody treated mm -hmm. us like like we were less than or that we were different or that our relationship wasn't valid. I think about watching her play, that was one of my favorite parts of being at Willie Mary was to get to, to see her compete as an athlete. And she's a record holder, was maybe, no longer. Still so, a record, just record. not number one. Okay. So, <laughs> you know, seeing her at the last moments of a game, hopefully we get to enjoy something like this tonight, uh, seeing her at the last moment of the game, being able to show up and just drain threes. So for, for me, knowing the challenges that you were going through, just coming out and, and that process, I knew watching you compete as an athlete, that you would be able to step up and just embrace the moment, even though it's really challenging, but knowing that you're gonna overcome and really come through a much stronger and better person, because I saw you do it week in and week out uh, when you're playing basketball. Yeah, I think we like to refer to that as like game time player and it's like that, that you know, horn goes off and when it's game time, it's game time. And I think we've carried that um, theme into our life. It's like when we need to do something that's difficult or challenging or, um, you know, just go through life, which is hard. It's like you step up, it's game time. And I think we've embraced that, that idea.